Hello friends, let's look at the real-life partners of the talented cast of The Bay. Enjoy! Marsha Thomason, who plays DS Jen Townsend, is 47 years old. She grew up in Moston, Manchester. Her father's English and her mother's Jamaican. Marsha first came to prominence on British television in 1997 in Series 5 of Pie in the Sky, playing the waitress Sally. She's also appeared on many American TV shows, including Lost, White Collar, and NCIS Los Angeles. Marsha Thomason has been happily married for 14 years now. In the early 2000s, she was working in the United States on several TV shows, including Lost, and met lighting technician Craig Sykes. Marsha and Craig married in April 2009 in Malibu, California. Their adorable daughter Tallulah was born in 2013 and will celebrate her 10th birthday this June. The happy family currently resides in sunny Los Angeles, but Marsha often travels back to her native UK to film new projects, including her most recent TV series The Bay and Cobra. Barry Sloan, who plays Chris Fisher, is 42 years old. Born and raised in Liverpool, England, Sloan is a trained musician who once dreamed of being the next Liam Gallagher, but instead became an actor, well known on both sides of the Atlantic. In the US for the TV shows Revenge and Longmire, and in the UK for Hollyoaks and Holby City. He also has a BAFTA nomination for portraying Captain Price in the video game Call of Duty Modern Warfare. This past November, Barry and his wife Katie celebrated their 10th wedding anniversary. The two eloped in Las Vegas in 2012 and then had a proper wedding a few months later. Katie has a degree in fashion design, and in 2008, she finished fourth in Series 3 of the Sky One reality competition series Project Can Walk. She's currently a spiritual teacher, light worker, and Reiki master focused on helping others to raise their consciousness. Katie was the one who encouraged and helped Barry to become sober three years ago. The couple has two adorable children. Their daughter Gracie is 12 years old now, and their son Lennon is six now. Daniel Ryan, who plays D.I. Tony Manning, is 54 years old. He was born in Colchiff near Warrington, Cheshire, and despite playing in a school band called Darker Than Shark, he chose to be an actor and graduated from the London Academy of Music and Dramatic Art. He started his career at the Royal Shakespeare Company. On TV, Ryan is best known for Mount Pleasant, Home Fires, and The Bay. Despite the fact that unlike many British actors, Daniel Ryan does have an Instagram account, the actor's very secretive about his personal life. A few times, his Instagram post featured a blonde boy who looks about 8 to 9 years old, and based on the comments, this boy is his son. Unfortunately, absolutely nothing is known about Daniel's potential wife, as he always attends red carpet events with co-stars only. Andrew Dalbiggin, who plays DS James Clark, is 45 years old, born in Leicester, England. Andrew moved to London to pursue a career in acting after working in the steel and construction industry. He trained as a postgraduate student at E15 Acting School and became an actor at the age of 30. Andrew Dalbiggin is another actor who is extremely protective of his personal life. His Instagram account is private and on Twitter he only shares his professional life. The actor is married to English actress Rebecca Hutchinson. Their love story is very romantic. They met and fell in love 10 years ago at the Whole Truck Theatre in Hull in the production of Jane Eyre, where Andrew played Mr. Rochester and Rebecca played Jane Eyre. Erin Janiger, who plays DS Karen Hobson, is 39 years old. She grew up down the Fylde Coast in Blankpool and currently lives in Manchester. She studied drama at the Fylde College and then Salford University. Erin got her big career break later in her career when she was 35 with the role on the bay. Erin's never been married. She's very secretive about her personal life, so we don't know if she's in a relationship now. When Erin was 8, her dad took her to a taekwondo lesson. By 14, she got the black belt, and during the lockdown, they trained on Zoom together. An advocate for gay rights as a founding member of Hive North Theatre Company, Shaniger used to deliver workshops about homophobia to schools around Greater Manchester. Georgia Scholes, who plays Erin Fisher, will be turning 22 this June. Not much is known about her background, but she's from the Greater Manchester area where she still resides. The Bay is only Georgia's second TV role. In 2020, she was in two episodes on Hollyoaks. 2022 
was a very eventful year for the 21-year-old actress. Not only did she get a major career break by being cast on the bay, in June, Georgia graduated from the Manchester University. And that's not all. In October, Georgia got married to Bartek Kalinski, and in December, she and her husband welcomed their daughter, Thea. Georgia was pregnant when filming Series 4, which was pretty obvious despite some clever camera angles. Bartek is a Polish immigrant who customizes cars for a living. The two met three years ago and have been inseparable since. Thomas Law, who plays DC Eddie Martin, is 30 years old. He was born in Hatfield, Hertfordshire, and grew up in Potter's Bar. He made his TV debut in 05 at the age of 13 in BBC One soap Casualty, and a year later landed a big role of Peter Beale on EastEnders, which he had for four years. It appears that Thomas is currently single, but he's definitely not lonely. The young actor lives with his parents and his two sisters, one of which recently got married, and often posts photos of his family and his adorable little nephew. Thomas and his family are so close they even vacation together. Besides acting, Thomas is a singer and an avid golfer. In the past, he dated American actress Sophia Carson, whom he met on the set of their 2016 family musical movie A Cinderella Story If the Shoe Fits, but they're no longer together. So, folks, who is your favorite character on the bay and why? And which actor's personal life intrigued you the most? Share with us in the comments. Please hit the thumbs up for this video and subscribe.